Ew. Royal Oak Crest. <laughs> Where are we going? We are going to El Moon, which is a Thai tea soft serve, but it also has boba. So, pain. I'm in pain. <laughs> no. It's a bitch to drive to this place, but this is the really like late night like soft serve place that I like. I'm vlogging like in the old days. Stop! Back in high school. What? Always trying to be in the vlog. You're fucking mean. Okay. Oh, I got your dad, Taro. So what is your personal favorite out of the drinks? My, my favorite is the jasmine milk tea. Do you guys have like the, um, what you want that, like where you blow the torch on? We do. There's oh, this one, like the these three. The tighter. These three drinks. Ooh. The Fire Rabbit, Type Fighter, and the Fire Dragon. What's, what do you mean by El Moon milk? I got, um. There you go. Yeah, they're making okay, your dad drink. Cool. Okay, I need to zoom out. Here. I already bit it. <laughs> oh. First thing you did it. So, what did you get? Ariel. So I got a nine ounce Thai tea soft serve with um, brown sugar syrup. That's what they recommend. It's pretty bomb. I usually get the small one because it's pretty big. So if you guys are trying to come over here, I would just get like a nine ounce because it's already like at this height. But if you're really like a Thai tea lover, I'll personally just get like a 16 ounce. You're good at this, you know that. You know what I mean? Oh, thanks. Um, but you can definitely request to not put any boba in it mm -hmm. because if you don't, if you think this is already sweet enough, it's perfect. But you can ask for easy boba as well. I got Mr. Pena, the one of the most uh, popular drinks. It's like uh, they use a torch, and on top is like a toffee brulee um, heavy cream topping, or like kind of like the Starbucks, like with the vanilla sweet cocoa, but not really. It's just like a thick consistency on top, and it's tight tea milk tea at the bottom, or in general the base of the drink, and then boba. So usually they do blow the torch in front of you. Unfortunately, we were too busy talking, so there's that. So on top is the toffee brulee um, consistency with heavy cream, and it's like blown with torch and tight tea milk tea and then boba. Where the fuck are my keys? Okay, so here we go. We have the boba ice cream that Ariel got me. I honestly forgot what it's called. What is it called again? What? What is this called again? It's ice cream. So it's a Thai tea soft serve. It has ice cream on the top. It's got some boba here on the side, as you saw in the inside. I'm gonna give it a quick try on the outside just in case I spill on the inside. Here you go. Oh, that's good. Whoa. Told you, I wouldn't take you anywhere if it's not good. Wait, try the one with, well, no, you have boba, so it has brown sugar anyways. Ah, oh, that's really good. It's like not super sweet. Like the tea flavor kind of like cuts down the sugar and it gives it a great taste. Like you don't get tired of the taste. Tip, the best Thai tea is always in the Vietnamese restaurants. Are they just do it the best? They do it better. They actually are like are more authentic personally. But I just personally think like in Vietnamese restaurants, like pho restaurants, real and authentic like Thai tea. This is good ice cream, Ariel. You're welcome. I'll do anything for food. As you can tell. What's we drove food? 30 minutes for this. Well, I just personally think this is a nice place if you're really sad or just doing late night studying and you want ice cream. If a local ice cream is already closed by 9 p.m., this is the best. Located in Upland, kind of near Rancho. Mom, right? Thai tea saucer. It's very good. It opens 11 to 11 p.m. It's What time is it right now? Ten something. See, right? Like it's currently ten twenty-two. They close at eleven. They open at eleven. It's great. You want some late night ice cream? They got you covered. For real. Cheers to our friendship, bro. Cheers. Wow, they're gonna go like. No, cheers, fool. The autofocus gets be moving. <laughs> it's moving the entire camera. I should have brought my tripod. I wish there was some shit like this 24 hours. Saku ramen. Ra it's saku ramen. I, I'm having the ramen right now, but their chazu fried rice. Fucking bomb. See, I basically know a lot of food places. So. This is who I gotta hang out with whenever I go eat food. Because she knows her way around food. I wish Ryan and Amber were here. I miss them. Oh, it's July 15th. Damn, Damn bro. Neil be going crazy right now. It's mock July 15th. Because since there's no wind. Look at this. Uh. 
focus, out of focus. <gasps> Joe won! I'm sorry, I got clean it. Look at oh it! I, wait, where is it? Oh, I accidentally spilled some on her that car. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> my poor car. You have a rag? Yes. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. I just washed him too. Well, we can make sure that he's clean again. Jesus fucking Christ, Jawan. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Give me the Oh my God. You lucky as hell I had that. We could have just asked for napkins. Yeah, but... I spilled the ice cream. <laughs> I, he wanted some, fool. I was just sharing. I was being nice. Lemon ice cream in a blend. Highly recommend you guys come. I usually don't like Thai tea as much as some other flavors. That's why I kind of hesitated at first when I saw that it was the flavor. But it's actually really good. Really? Mm-hmm. And here we are. 20 and 21. Oh. Damn. So somebody was zooming, right? Damn. Oh, wow. Look over there. La Luna. Oh, no, it's too zoomed in. I mean, it's not zoomed in enough. You are surprised you don't have earrings, bro. Why? Why are you surprised? I don't know. Like you and Ryan, I'm surprised you guys don't have earrings. Maybe there's parties, Upland. That's probably why there's so many like cars and stuff like that. I'm almost done. I need to get myself Crocs, bruh. Smell it. it. Smells so nice. Oh, that does smell so nice. I only pick the best ones. I don't like sweet ones. This one's, this one's pretty sweet, no? No, this is like, camera, this is like a, like a floral scent, fresh. How would you rate your experience here at Le Moon? I say an 8.5. Because the people were nice, but the drive is a bitch. The drive is a bitch. <laughs> But the ice cream was really good. If you guys looking, are looking for some late night ice cream and are willing to make somewhat of a drive, depending on where you are, we're in Southern California. So Starting up in with... Upland, we have Le Moon. Highly recommend you guys come and visit because the ice cream is great. Thai soft serve ice cream. We got a small. Oh, what's wrong with there? The rich ass. Look, they have a nice Tesla right next to us. The one that kind of pulls up. I wish I was rich, guys. I wonder if she's dressed so fancy with a 